Hello everyone, it's me Evan, and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a rudimentary rangefinder. So that's this little, this little guy there. And when it activates, it will, uh, it will blink when something is a certain distance away. And I'm just going to demonstrate that on my MiG-21, or 29, sorry, <laughs> my MiG-29 because I like it and it's had a lot of work put into it. So let's go into the editor and check out how it works. So right here, we've got a little green light. And this is bound to custom channel 26 um, because all the other channels are being used by things. Um, it doesn't really matter what channel it is as long as it's the same channel as this little sensor right here. So this is a proximity sensor. It's got an upper bound of uh, 1200 or <laughs> I guess 1,200 yeah. and it's 26 so as you can see there yeah that should yeah so I guess if I there we go yes yeah, so you can see that it's bound to that sensor and then this is bound in turn to this button in here which says target range so yeah, this is it's got a 500 meters. Your max input basically you want to set your min min input high, and then your max input should be um, what range you actually want. So if it was going to be 200 meters, I'd put 200 in there. But yeah, we want 500 meters because that's about how how far away I want to be before I fire missiles and things like that at ground targets. So yep, that's. Uh, that's all. That's it's pretty simple, and you just have this on strobe. You know, it's it's pretty simple. You can also have this always on. You don't have to have it bound to a button like this. Um, and if you have it always on, then it will always flash, which you might not want, or you might want. It depends on like if you're in a tank or something. Maybe you'll have it always on, or you could even have a, a button. So, for instance, if I wanted to have this bound to Let's say uh, I want this bound to disable steering, right? And so now, let's uh, take off here. As you can see, I'm looking at the ground, nothing's happening. And then I hit disable steering, I look at the ground, there you go. So you can really, you can bind it up any way you want. And it's very simple, very easy to do. Uh, you can also have this sort of sensor bound to things like explosives and and that kind of thing. Um, so if you want a proximity detonated mine, for instance, you can use the same proximity sensor with these kind of setup. Um, sensor cannons, really anything. The proximity sensor is one of the most powerful uh, tools in this game really because there's just so many things you can do with it but that'll be all that's that's been my little rudimentary rangefinder and I, I hope you guys found that useful and have a good day see ya